Let's begin with a word of prayer and we'll move right along into today's lesson. We thank you, Lord, for this time we have to learn and grow. We seek to do the best we can and add to what we know. We love you, God, with all our hearts and to others' love we show. Pleasing you is our goal. Now to our lesson, we should go. In Jesus' name, amen. Hello, boys and girls, moms and dads. Welcome to Heroes Modern School Academy. This is fifth grade mathematics, week number 27 and day number five. All right, so today we're going to be doing a quick review of Pythagoras' theorem. What is Pythagoras' theorem? Pythagoras' theorem is a formula that we can use to determine the hypotenuse of a right-angled triangle. All right, this is called an hypotenuse. Well, the line that connects the two that connects the eyes and the sides together is called the hypotenuse. So we want to use a formula to determine that that hypotenuse. Well, what's that formula? Well, that formula is going to be equivalent to AC squared, which is the hypotenuse in this situation, is going to be equivalent to AB squared plus BC squared. All right. Now, in this particular situation, they're telling us that, well, if we have Y over here, BC is going to be equivalent to Y, and AB is going to be equivalent to Y. What is AC squared? Now, they told us AC squared is going to be 98, so we can say 98 is going to be equivalent. Remember, we're not going to say 98 squared anymore because they told us AC squared is 98, okay? So 98 is going to be equivalent to this Y squared plus Y squared, all right? Which... This is going to be 2y squared is 98, right? So 98 divided by 2 is going to be equivalent to y squared. And this is going to be equivalent to 49 equals y squared. So y is going to be the square root of 49, right? So which number can you multiply by itself to give you 49? Well, that's going to be... Guess what? 7 multiplied by 7, right? So the square root is going to be equivalent to 7. If you remember your timetable very well, 7 times 7 is going to be equivalent to 49. All right. Did you get something from it? Well, that's going to be Pythagoras' theorem for you. Let's go ahead and turn to page number 193 uh, for additional tips to understand how this thing works a little bit better. Well, I want to thank you, boys and girls, for joining me today. Remember, God cares about you, and so do we. Bye-bye. I'll be your hero's body And as you study With heroes born I'll be your friend So don't you worry